of our suspect, and we were able to recover, first of all, from him, one smartphone, that is the first one here. Then we proceeded to his house, our officers proceeded to his house, and uh, we recovered some other seven smartphones, which are displayed as well, and then two other phones. Also in the same house, we were able to recover two hard drives, that we believe I've got enough uh, information. In his phone that he had at hand, there were pictures of ladies, photos, and uh, some video videos that he had recorded. We also recovered uh, two USB and memory card. We also recovered uh, nine ID cards, six for men and three for ladies. We also recovered down 24 Airtel SIM cards and their orders, which he has, we believe he has used. And these are the ones he has been using in the Commission of Crimes. We also recovered industrial drugs, which we believe he was using while dismembering. A rope? That resembles the ones that were that one that was used to try up the sacks. We have nylon bags, twelve of them, which as well re resemble the the nylon bags that uh, were recovered with bodies that were dismembered inside the dam. We have a, a, a radius pass, which we suspect is belongs to one of his victims. A reflector jacket. We have a laptop that was also recovered. We have a machete that uh, he, in the course of investigation, he confesses to have been using to dismember the bodies. We have two uh, underwears, uh, which we believe belongs to the victims. There are also uh, three, two title deeds that are in his name, and some notebooks that he has records that we believe will be very important in the course of our investigation. He also had uh, some Kenyan money with him and uh, five uh, sticks of a substance that we suspect is cannabis sativa. We have our suspect with us and the interrogation is still going on. Thank you, sir. The, we also finally, so I had forgotten the cell tapes, four of them. Those who witnessed those victims that were collected from the dam, there are some elements of these cell tapes which you believe sometimes could have been used to tie up the dismembered parts of the body and as well to mask them mouths so that the victims do not make noise. Thank you. <laughs> 